Friends, listen to me. We're going to drink a lot over the next 100 days. Many of us in the room are going to drink a tremendous amount of scripture and we're going to sip on political commentary. Others among us are going to drink heavily on political commentary and sip on scripture. And I want you to know that the world is going to know what we're drinking because it's going to come out of our mouth. They're going to know what we're feeding on. They're going to know what we're drinking on. They're going to know, I know, when your posts and your emails are dripping more because you've been sipping at the water fountain and not sipping, drinking at the water fountain of CNN or Fox than the Bible. The Bible. Where Jesus has already spoken truth about the dignity of human life in the womb to the tomb. The Bible. Where he's already spoken about personal responsibility as the primary means of our own individual provision. The Bible, where he's already spoken about marriage between a man and a woman, the dignity of the human family, the bedrock to society that the human family is. The Bible, where he speaks about the poor, the immigrant, the widow, the orphan, justice. The Bible, his word must be our guide. How tragic it would be for us to be so entrenched that we who would be entrusted with the word of God would only echo the world's fear at such a time as this. He is the sovereign king of heaven and earth. 